Hello, hello everyone, welcome along to another episode of 7 Days to Die. We're here on day 6, well the morning of day 6. And uh, I think, because we didn't do it yesterday, I mentioned that I'd done stuff yesterday, but I never actually showed you guys. I think we should head, oops, head down. Uh, let's, let's turn that off. Let's head down to, oops. <laughs> What a start. Let's head down to the base that we're building in Dyersville. See how it's getting on. Um, I did level up overnight. And I also spent the skill points that we uh, had accrued through the near death experience that we had in yesterday. But uh, today I, I want to... I wouldn't mind clearing out the, one of these POIs around where we're going to have our base. I've also crafted some new boots. I think it's technically armor, I'm not actually sure. Well, if we go along here, this is how far I've gotten with the base. I think it looks quite cool. The zombies? Disappointed. Yeah, we're, get, we're, we're certainly getting there with it. Now, you'll notice that there are... Uh, where can I put this? I'll put this there. You notice that there's these iron frames in this middle bit. I don't expect the zombies to be attacking this floor piece whatsoever. Uh, so what I'm going to do is uh, place down the supports for the base. Because the base obviously isn't going to be down here. That would be craziness. Let's see, that's one, two, three three and four, that's more than I needed actually. Yeah, we'll put the, we'll put all of them in anyway. Right. These are rebar frames, I made them in the forge. I was also looking through the loot that I got from yesterday and uh, we did actually quite well, we got a nice MG. Didn't even notice. Uh, if I jump off of here, am I going to break a leg? No. Cool. I don't want to... I don't know if I can go all the way. I don't have normal frames on me either. Uh, let's craft, I don't know, 50 frames. I guess I kind of want to... Make myself a little staircase up here because I would be saddened greatly if uh, my rebar frames fell. There we go. That that should be just peachy. I reach that on the end. There can I get one on there. There we go. All right, let's. Ah. Uh, Boo. Right, so this base is not square anymore. That's that's a thing. Uh, where's my axe? Alright, let's see. If I put a block right there. It's, yeah, it's, it's not even close to square. So that the very middle of the base I think. I think we'll have that as the front so if I put that there again and put a rebar frame right there I'll uh, know what I'm doing with that come on there there we go but hopefully you're all having a wonderful day I'm certainly excited to be back playing this game do love me about seven days today Probably more than I should. Something about blowing up zombie skulls is just fun and exciting. Let's upgrade these as much as we can. We don't have a massive supply of 
concrete. Hopefully we have enough to do this though. Uh, can I reach these top corner frames and get those done as well? That would be pleasant and good and stuff. There we go. Let's see. We'll do a few until I run out. Let's see if we can get some of this done. There we go. There we ran out. That's fine. No problem at all. Right, but what I'm going to do is I want to make some Oh, cobblestone frames, if uh, not cobblestone frames, just flagstone. That's that's what I'm looking for. Flagstone blocks. I don't know. I think forty if we can get away with it. And I'm also going to need a few wooden plates. And by a few, I mean probably f twenty-nine. I suppose. Yeah, let's put that away. I want these out. And what I've been doing is putting these along here like so. Make sure we always have two in the inventory. Now, as you can see, the reason the plates are there is because it gives this weird dip and I don't want the zombies to get caught in it. And then start trying to dig under the base because that would be bad. That would be very bad. I have done a bit of upgrading a lot of this by accident. I'll be honest there, I did accidentally upgrade to the iron all the way through to the concrete, but what can you do? I really like a cement mixer. That That's a thing that it would be awesome. We do have one that we marked in the snow biome in that direction, just over there. And what we might do is we might take a little gander over there. I don't need any more of them, so we'll get rid of those. Get these wooden plates on the go. I don't think I can make enough of these, so we are going to have to chop down a few trees, but I'll probably just do that off camera. But you can kind of see what I'm going for here. Oh, well, we might have enough. If we have too many, it's fuel for the fire. Ah, we're a few short. Let's, uh, it's too quiet here. I don't like it. That's my hammer, not my axe. What am I doing? Nice big tree here to chop down. Get some decent wood from it. Probably won't take it all down because I know that uh, that would just annoy you guys. So I'll do. We'll make, uh, I think, five more should do it. You can see how the base is coming along. Now there is a construction site right over there that we might actually just go over and... Uh, I do have a shovel on me. Uh, I've take a note and put my bandages on my hot bar. Very important thing to do. I'm just going to have a look at this uh, construction site POI that I was on about. It's just over here. I have already taken some concrete and cobblestone from the top. Not at all as you can see. Don't know if this cement mixer works. Ah, it's destroyed. That is a shame. Destroyed workbench. Now, when I came here before, I solely came here for the purpose of digging up the cobblestone and con concrete so I didn't loot anything at all. Where are all the zombies though? I do not like it when it's quiet. That worries me. I, I hear you. I don't, I don't see you. But I hear you. A bit more concrete in there. More cops. I didn't go in. Oh, there's a hole over there. This feels dungeony. Okay. 
Right, there's one construction worker there and another. Oh, we woke him up. Where's my bow? Can we get a headshot on this guy? Look at that. There's a hospital over there. Where did that construction worker go? I'll be honest, I'm not a fan of walking over this stuff. Oh, look at that mess in there. Something very horrific happened in this POI. I missed him, really? Oh, oh, I, I sincerely apologize. But, on the, on, you know what? <laughs> Have a nap. Sleep it off. You'll be fine. I'm not worried about picking my arrows up either. Look at that. Oh, that. That, that looks... Oh. Poor, poor... Nah, never mind. I don't care. <laughs> there we go. Better, better concrete. Let's go and see if we can at least get... Where, where's my bike? We'll be done with it. There it is. It's only yellow. Hard to see, you know? Let's get a little bit more of this done and... Uh, what we could do is we could head over to the... Oh, come on. Really? Just reinforced concrete this is coming out of us. This, this looks like reinforced concrete. I'm not going to complain, but I'm going to head over to the cement, make sure that we know what work, knows it works. No, we're all oh, words. Oh, come on. Going over to the cement, make sure that we know works. And uh, I'm going to get some trees on the way as well. I might take some from here on the way back, but. Uh, I'll get you guys again when I'm back at the base. Okay guys, I've actually been working away for quite a while and realised I wasn't recording so uh, yeah, let me just get, get you up to date. Um, I have went and got a whole heap of concrete from the concrete mixer, I was back and forth at the base a few times making some cement. I cleared out the majority of the POI over there to get some more, blew up a barrel, hurt myself quite badly as I do. Um, I picked up a loot drop, as you can see by all this food, and uh, I've made some barbed wire. I've started working on the defences. There's barbed wire on the ground there. It goes over there, and then we've got these spikes here. Now, I don't currently have any more forged iron, but I managed to get one of these done. So if I bring this back out, is it still going to be? No, it's not. If you're wondering how to put barbed wire on the ground, hold R down and click on Advanced. Or, if you've already got some down, you can just copy rotation. And you can go like that. Nice nice and easy. Now I'm going to leave it open because I want those spikes to be um, upgraded to the iron spikes. Because I want this base to be very, very defended. Everything's going to be done in concrete. Um, apart from, but I don't expect them to break that. I don't expect them to punch down because I'm going to be down here shooting at them so that's a thing um, I have some torches on me so I'm going to put those up oh, oh I've got three of them so I'm going to put them up here and that will light this area up um, oh, where did I leave my bike? I think I left it over here this time yeah it's right there I'm really bad at leaving that thing lying around um, I need to figure out what I'm going to do to actually hold the zombies back. Now I do want one block here that is not going to it's, it's going to have barbed wire on it. Obviously I don't need to do this just now. Um, I'm just marking it out to the same on this side just to just so we know what we're doing here. It is extremely extremely unlikely that this base is going to be ready for horde night but it's only, it's only a day seven horde it's not going to be that bad surely hopefully i'll be able to hold them off on the bridge and um, we've run out of iron awesome amazing i love running out of iron i don't even think i have a wrench on me i don't cool i used a lot of my forge iron making this ladder i shouldn't have bothered i should have just made a wooden ladder i also uh, made this Another waste of iron. But what can you do? It is what it is. 
There's not been much in the way of zombies. I've killed three, four zombies. Um, not exactly anything to write home about. But what we're going to do just now is we're going to head back to the uh, working stiffs tools and we're going to see if we can craft away some more forged iron. I know I have some forged iron that I've been making in there. So we'll get working on that. We'll go and pick that up and uh, I, I grossly underestimated the amount of concrete that it's going to actually take to do this. I'd really like to make a cement mixer. I think. I'm going to assume you need a workbench for that, which we don't currently have. I haven't found one yet. But it'd be nice to have one well, here. <laughs> And the other thing I'd like to do is I'd like to make a mine somewhere around here. In case you're wondering, by the way, that POI, the bit that looks like all sorts of horrific things have happened, there is a bear under there. So if you're going to be raiding that POI, be prepared for there being a bear in that hole. I was lucky enough that I got, uh, I went into the, the hole that was there, seen the bear and uh, just just went, nope, not, not dealing with that just now. I would like to go back and deal with that at some point. We might do that today. There we go, run out of concrete again. I'm so sick of hearing that sound. And um, we might go back and deal with it later on today. I, I'm not sure. We'll, we'll just have to wait and see. Um, stamina is an issue. I think the boots I'm wearing are armor. And I don't have any skill points in armor, but I do have a skill point available. Two of them, in fact. Because the leveling, I suppose. Uh, do, 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 do. Kind of want a sexual Tyrannosaurus because reasons. Uh, da, 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 da. Heavy armor. We'll get that. You start working towards getting some armor on the go. Not that we have the iron to make anymore. I've used so much iron. But yeah, we are probably going to have to rebuild this bridge at some point because it's probably going to come down. And uh, well, despite my fortifications, it's it's just I'm not that bothered. I'll just make my own bridge. But we do definitely need to get unencumbered. I keep getting worried that I'm going to come back here and this place is going to have zombies respawned. I took the forge down from there already. But luckily I can create 88 more, so that's a thing. Hey, let's... Oh, I got machete. Uh, blue denim. Let's... Scrap them. I scrap that as well. Scrap the lead fishing weight. We've got some food. Another couple of hunting rifles. Let's scrap that level one. And we'll scrap. How much of these are worth? 106, 111. We'll scrap this one. We've got loads of hunting rifles. And if we're doing fine for food. No problem at all for food. I would like a better marksman's rifle though. That That is a thing I would like. Right, let's get this food put away. Got a jar of honey in there already. I'm very pleased about that machete being a thing. Uh, we got some coal because I did break open a couple of rocks. Just didn't get an awful lot of iron from them, obviously. Uh, not going to keep level 1 stuff anymore. It's just not worth it. Um, we'll get that serrated blade. We'll take that. Got some lead sitting there. That's not useful to us just now. <laughs> Loads of clay soil. I'm encumbered. What a surprise. Let's see if we can modify this with serrated blade. Awesome stuff. And um, we can just drop the bone shiv because now we've got a machete. Aha! Kinda want a zombie to turn up now so I can beat them up with my machete. Yeah, I'm wondering, do you think we'll ever actually be able to see our base from here? I don't think we will because I don't think custom structures uh, are spawned in the viewing distance. But uh, that's fine. But yeah. The problem with these frames is I am probably going to end up accidentally picking the, like one of them up and falling to my death come tomorrow night. But we'll deal with that tomorrow. 
Today I want to do a bit more working on the base, so I'm going to go and gather some resources and I will be back very soon guys. So I'll see you guys in just a second. Okay guys, it's 5pm now. I did roll the time back a little bit again. I, I did, I've done that twice in this episode so far. But uh, I've been doing a little bit more work on the base. I've um, I've done some stuff around here actually. Say goodbye to the working stiffs sign there, the lamp post and the one that was on the wall here. They're all gone. This is no longer a working stiffs, it's now mine. I'm actually tempted to take that bridge out, being completely honest. But I did get hold of a bit of iron, not as much as I'd like. I went around for quite some time. Um, made quite a bit of forged iron as you can see. Did get the... Did get the... Spikes. Done up. The way I wanted them to. 16. I'll craft those. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't think of the sooner. Just taking these. Apart from the one that the campfire's sitting on, obviously, but. Yeah, don't know why I completely patched these all together. Didn't even think about them. Yeah, we'll get these all taken out as well. We'll get the rest of. Well, we'll not get all of these taken out. If you're wondering about the pickaxe, I have no idea where it came from either. I found it in a chest. I've been thinking for ages I didn't have one, but uh, well, I did. I have repaired it. I, I can make a pickaxe, can I not? Yeah, I can make them. No, I don't have the thing. But I could potentially make them soon. I'm encumbered. But we need all the iron in the world there's a lot of it actually has to go into here Oops. that's got a thousand in there that'll do 31 rebar frames and I don't know how we're looking for cement I did a little bit more of that as well but like I said I'm not I'm not sure how much we've got oh First zombie I've seen since the last time we were on. Oh. Oh. Have a nap. It's not, it's not as good as the club. I, I, I prefer the club. I was saying that we did actually see a zombie. I just ignored him. Ran him over twice with the bicycle. Never seen him again. I don't know if he decided to give up on life and or on death. Now you see around here, I've taken all of the stones out of here as well, bar the ones down here. These ones will be next. And I can't say that Dyerville sign is particularly safe from the wrath of me collecting iron either. Um, but as for work that I've done to the base, you'll see it's looking a little bit different. I don't know if you can particularly tell from this distance. There's a bit of iron right there actually. Let's, uh... Let's see how I have that. Some more in the ground there as well. <clears throat> what I've done here is I've got a lot of this done up with concrete. Let's have a look. Do I have any more? No, I don't. Well, these rebar frames are just going to stay bare then. But you can see, maybe not with that. I've got the rest of the bar wire put up to this point. There does need to be another roll of it, but I'll wait for that just now. All of these spikes are upgraded to the iron spikes. Like I said, I want this place to be a beast of a base. And we'll get these rebar frames dropped in here because of reasons. Now, if you're wondering how I'm going to get in and out of this base, I haven't actually figured that out yet. Um, I made too many of these. Uh, there's worse problems to have in life, I suppose. I haven't actually figured out how I'm actually going to get in and out of here yet. Um, it'll be something up the top. Um, I may like bridge out over that way or something. That seems like a good idea. Maybe bridge out over there and over there and uh, create like a small drop or something um, that maybe only we can get up with, with frames. Um, do I have any more of those plates yet? Flagstone plate. How many can I make? 39. Well, we'll craft all of those. It's, it's going to take a bit of time now. I'm, I'm thirsty. As you can see, I'm not 
exactly enthusiastic about the uh, distinct lack of uh, the zombos that are not kicking about. It's like, where are they? Let's get all these upgraded as far as we can, because these ones are going to be exposed. Now, what I've done here is we have poles on the corner. I need to make more of that. Uh, cobblestone rocks. How many can I make? I'll take it. Might seem wasteful, but I can always get more rock. That's not a problem. More materials needed, as usual. I put poles in it. Really? Ah, oh, it's because I'm making these first. That's that's. It's understandable. Alright, I'm gonna upgrade these ones first of all because Well Oh iron issues again. Alright, well I guess we're not gonna be upgrading those. These plates, where are these plates going? Where are they getting put? Alright, because what I'm gonna do here is copy rotation. Need to be very careful here not to walk into my deadly spikes. I'm gonna put these on the outside. This is just simply gonna give that concrete block that's going in there where the rebar frame is a little bit of extra protection. That's something I learned from Glock 9's recent videos on his Horde Every Night series. He did that with his uh, with his base. I thought it was a brilliant idea. And Glock Nine also does seven days to die videos. So if you if you're enjoying this type of content, definitely go and check them out. Definitely worth a watch. I certainly spend quite a lot of my time watching them. And I tempted to do across the top too, but nah. Do we? For structure reasons. How many rebar frames do I have? Where did my rebar frames go? Got a couple of flagstone blocks. Wouldn't be a bad idea just making my flagstone. Yeah, but then again, we do have nine rebar frames. Well, we'll mix and match. I got four left. Let's put those there. Flagstone block, I want, I don't know, 20 of them. 20 seems like plenty. Let's stop that because that's going to take 10 minutes. <coughs> uh, where are they going? They're going there. So I'll get this all filled in like this. This is more of a structure thing. I don't expect the zombies to hit these, so I'm not going to bother to put plates on them. Let's see, let's stop that and stop that because I now need some bars. Now, these don't have the greatest hit points as I can show you. Well, I if I stick that right there, that's not the right kind of bars anyway. I'll just use the hammer and I'll show you. I only have 300 hit points. That's kind of useless. What I'd really like to have is... Uh, can I scrap this? I certainly can. What I'd really like to have is the iron bars, but my god, they are expensive. And we need what? Oh dear. Oh, well, fair enough. And we need 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, so it's 20. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. Oh, that's something like 4,000 iron. So maybe we'll just do them out of... That seems really wasteful. They'll definitely get through them. Only 300 hit points. It's not even worth doing. Um, the only other thing I can think that would maybe be worth doing is... Let's do a little test and... I can shoot through rebar frames. What kind of hit points do they have? 
50. Never mind. Never. That was a terrible idea. Don't know what I was thinking. Just, just ignore that. Um, but I would like to do... Well, maybe go about collecting a bit more iron. I might end up... Uh, sneakily changing time again. I should just set it so that it's 120 minute days. Because... Yeah. No reason not to, is there? But, uh, yeah. I'll, um, we'll maybe leave this for now. I'll uh, work on getting a bit more cement mix between this episode and the next and hopefully get the cement put in place for those. I'll see if I can get hold of some iron overnight as well. And uh, I said that we're not doing terrible for iron, I don't think. Let me just check. Yeah, we're doing terrible for iron. I need a more effective way of getting iron. Oh, I didn't search this. Eight feathers. I will take it. If I put those in there. Uh, do, 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 do. Ooh, that's definitely tempting. I'll craft four of those for structure and science. Where did they go? Where are they? Give them a Where are they? There. There they are. Right, so if I could put these here. Can I not? Can I not? Yeah, there. There and there. Now I can shoot through these, kind of. I wonder if I'm a little bit off, does it? Yeah, it does hit, so. But it will save us on a bit of resources doing that. I'm almost tempted to put them here as well. Hmm. Not sure what to do. Yeah, you know go. Let's do this. Go for it. Need eight more. Why not? What's the worst that could happen? If it's wrong, we'll just break them and do it again. Um, am I actually making more cobblestone? I should be. I should be getting that going while I'm not crafting anything else. Alright, let's see. We want one... here. Two from the end. Something like that. It's, it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. I mean, a lot like a base. Yeah, for structure and science. So now we need two, four, six, eight, sixteen. Ah, we need a lot less now. A ah, hell of a lot less. So let's upgrade these. We, we are definitely going to want these as concrete. So this is a potential point of weakness for our base now, actually. Didn't think about that. Because these things only have, what, 1500 hit points? That's not an awful lot. So, hmm. Maybe when they're fully upgraded to reinforced concrete or something, it might be worth it. I'm going to carry on with this. Um, I don't expect anything else to happen tonight, so bit of an earlier end to the episode. Um, it's quiet around. Oh. If, if anything happens between now and midnight, I'll bring you guys back. But like I said, I don't expect anything to. And I'll crack on with try to get some more of this done. Because I would like it to be somewhat useful on day 7 if we need to. But uh, like I said, I'll see you guys in the next one. If you enjoyed this video, you can hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, you can hit the subscribe button. And you can also follow me on Twitter. It's at Ghosty Gaming uh, GB. Um, I follow all gamers back, and uh, I look forward to seeing you over there. You can also check the description of this video for a link to Discord, where um, I will very happily have a chat with you guys. I spend quite a lot of time on Discord, so it is the best place to get me. But uh, yeah, I will see you guys on day seven. 
Fortnite. Bye for now.